As we have seen both managed tables as well as external tables, let us compare and contrast between managed tables and external tables. If you do not specify any keyword between create and table, it is by default managed table. When we say external and specify the location or location alone as part of create table, it makes the table external when it comes to Spark Metastore. In Hive, it is not the case. You can specify the location even for managed table and it will work. But if it is Spark Metastore table, Typically, even if you do not specify external as part of the create table, if you specify the location, it will by default make it as external. In some versions, it might not be exhibiting the same behavior, but in some versions, it will be the case. Rest of the syntax is same as managed table. However, the major difference is when we drop managed table, it will delete metadata from Metastore as well as data from HDFS. However, when we drop external table, only metadata will be dropped, not the data. Typically, we use external table when same data set is processed by multiple frameworks such as Hive, Pix, Spark, etc. Also, we cannot run truncate table command against external tables. So, the two differences are when we drop the external table, only metadata will be dropped. The actual data will not be dropped. Whereas with managed table, it will drop both the data as well as the metadata from the Metastore. And also, when it comes to truncate table, we can only use it on uh, managed tables. We will not be able to use it on external tables. So, in this case, Orders is of type external. You can confirm by running uh, this command called as uh, describe formatted. Let me copy paste that command from the previous topic real quick. And you can see that the table is of type external. Now I am trying to truncate this table called as orders and it is failing. It also have uh, another table. When I say it, it is nothing but the database. The database IT versus retail have another table called as order items. We can confirm by running show tables here. You can see there is another table called as order items. And order items is of type uh, manage table. We can confirm by running uh, describe formatted on order items. And you can see that it is of type managed. As it is managed table, I can truncate this without any issues truncate table order underscore items. There are no errors. However, with respect to external table, it said truncate table on external tables is not allowed. So that is the difference between uh, managed table and external table. Now, if you drop the orders, which is uh, external table, the location which is pointed by this table, if I go back to the describe formatted command, you can actually get the location from here. This is the location. If you validate this location, still the files will be there, even though the table is dropped. So I'm validating from the CLI by saying HDFS DFS hyphen LS and by pasting the path. I forgot to copy the forward slash at the beginning. Let me add it and let me run it. You can see that the file and folder are intact even though the table is dropped. However, as we dropped the order items, which is a managed table, which was under this location, user IT was T or uh, environment variable user warehouse itversity underscore retail dot db and if you run this command you will not be seeing any files under order items if we truncate so i have already truncated this uh, order items you can see here okay even though the folder exists for the table the folder will not contain any files because the files are deleted when we actually run the truncate table command now it is empty. Now if I go back here and if I run drop table command on order items, even the folder will be gone. Both the metadata from the Metastore as well as the folder and files pointed by the table will be gone. It will say no such file or direct. You can even uh, validate at database level and you will not be seeing any order items folder here. So these are the differences between a managed table and external tables. When it comes to dropping the table, if it is external table, it will only drop the metadata. It will not touch the files. Whereas with respect to managed tables, it will drop both the files as well as the metadata. Also truncate is permitted on managed table, but not on the external table.